Let us continue with the Masonic calendar. There are a total of five different calendars that are used by Freemasons. Craft Masonry's calendar commences with the creation of the world and uses the term Inelucious meaning in the year of light. To arrive at this date, they add 4,000 to the common time, as the Earth was believed in conventional theology to have begun in 4,000 BC. Therefore the year 2007 becomes 6,007. Royal Archmasons, date time from the year of the Second Temple, was commended by Zerbebel. Anno Inventionis, which means in the year of discovery, is the terminology used by chapters. This adds 530 to the common time, therefore the year 2007 becomes 2537. Royal and Select Masters, or Cryptic Masons, date from the year in which the Temple of Solomon was completed. It is called Anno Depositionis, which means in the year of the deposit, and adds 1000 to the common time. Therefore the year 2007 becomes 3007. Knights Templar start their calendar with the formation of the order in 1118 AD. Anno Ordinus, which means in the year of the order, is the terminology used. This deducts 1118 from the common time. Therefore the year 2007 becomes 889. The Scottish Rite date the same as Craft Masons, except for the use of the Jewish chronology. Anulundi, which means, in the year of the world, is their calendar terminology, and adds 3760 to the common time. Therefore the year 2007 becomes 5767. The Chamber of Reflection is present only in certain Masonic rites. It's a small room in which the candidates are left on their own for a period before the initiation ceremony begins. Seated at a table, they write their philosophical will, which is later to be read out in the lodge. The initiate is alone with a sheet of paper and a pencil. The Chamber of Reflection is lit only by a candle, which casts its feeble light on a number of ornaments, a human skull, some bones, a lump of bread, a flask of water, an hourglass, a saucer containing salt and another containing sulfur. On the wall are murals painted in white on a black background, a cockerel, a scythe, and the word vitriol, or vitrolum which is the ancient command to examine oneself. The chamber exists in the ancient and accepted Scottish Rite and Continental European Lodge, but not in the Emulation Rite. How do we penetrate years, centuries of historical distortion to find original truth? Tonight, this will be our quest. Throughout the ages, the ruling elite have known that man is not alone in the universe. 
Dios.